strength and determination through adversity. Comedian John <laughs> played a significant role in making the redesign of the hey. We'll never be able to Thank God. Thank God. Hey, but the least we can do is provide them a place of comfort, solace, and community <laughs> on the memorial with their brothers. Like, would you turn over? Turn over. Saved and helped. That they know is a testament to all they did for us and all they did for the city. As many as 400,000 people were exposed to the toxic air at Ground Zero, and more than 87,000 have enrolled in the World Trade Center Health Program. Hey! Don't you dare take the dog. Really? Until 8,000 pounds of steel fell on his foot. He's now a victim's advocate who's been to 179 funerals. That's cute. I can't celebrate this, though, because um, a year ago yesterday, my best friend died from 9-11 cancer, and, uh, <clears throat> sorry. I take this personal. This dedicated space will remind all who come here how the best of our human nature responded to the worst. How human dignity triumphed over human depravity. This is cute. We haven't actually broken ground yet, and it's not clear when this redesign will be finished. It could be months or perhaps sometime next year. The folks here say they just want to make sure they get it right. In New York, Rick Leventhal, Fox News. Next at noon, he grew Starbucks into the brand we know today. Well, now there's speculation that Howard Schultz so could have 